In the latest COVID-19 news, state health officials are looking ahead to the long-term impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. KSBY News supporter Austin Herbal has more on a condition that could be impacting hundreds of thousands of Californians. Long COVID, it's a condition that can cause ongoing physical, neurological, and mental health issues. A new study out of the UK found that nearly one out of 50 people reported long COVID symptoms. If we extrapolate that to nearly 40 million Californians, that could be close to 800,000 persons self-reporting long COVID symptoms in our state. So it is no wonder that the COVID pandemic is also referred to as a mass disabling event. It's a condition that sticks around after the virus is gone. Symptoms include fatigue, rapid heart rate, shortness of breath, and brain fog. That can include short-term memory loss and difficulty doing normal tasks. Brain fog is really debilitating and I think, you know, from a societal level, this is one of the symptoms that's really preventing people from going back to work full-time, from kind of re-engaging in their daily lives. Doctors say that experiencing symptoms for 12 weeks or longer is considered true long COVID. Other signs include increased anxiety and depression, all symptoms that can have various causes. A lot of the symptoms, especially like the neurologic and kind of the, the mental health type symptoms, you know, it's impossible to tease out what is truly caused by long COVID and what is caused by kind of the collective trauma that everyone's experienced from two years of living in the pandemic. And I don't know that we'll ever truly sort that out. Medical experts are now working on a unified response. Reporting in San Luis Obispo, Austin Herbach, KSBY News. The California Senate will discuss how to deal with the ongoing impasse of long COVID during a Senate committee hearing tomorrow.